The FAA is grounding SpaceX fleet of Falcon 9 rockets after a fiery failed landing attempt. SpaceX successfully launched a batch of Starlink internet satellites yesterday, but when they tried to land the rocket's reusable booster on a barge off the coast, it caught fire and fell into the ocean. ABC News transportation reporter Sam Sweeney joins me now for more. Sam, failed landings by SpaceX are rare and so are groundings. So how significant is this and why did the FAA make this call? Well, the FAA made the call because they want to ensure that the public remains safe during these launches, and that's exactly what they're trying to figure out. They are waiting for uh, results, data from SpaceX to explain what happened here, why it happened here, and how they're going to prevent it from happening again, and ultimately determine if there is a public safety threat. What you said earlier, that rocket took off with those Starlink satellites, um, and when that booster was uh, landing on a pad out in the water, uh, it toppled over and caught fire. Of course, that is not supposed to happen. It's been used more than 20 times before, so they've got to figure it out what went wrong before they can begin to uh, use those boosters again. And, and SpaceX is also trying to launch four private astronauts for the first ever commercial spacewalk. This mission by Polaris Dawn, it's, it was already scrubbed twice over helium leaks. So what's the latest on that mission, which would make history once it happens? Well, that mission likely will be on hold for quite some time. Now, there was another opportunity to launch overnight tonight. That likely won't happen because of the FAA grounding um, and the amount of time it's going to take to get that data to the FAA and then, of course, get a plan in place uh, and approved by the FAA for launch. And you're also looking at weather obstacles. The weather does not look favorable for the return when they come back in five days. So that's going to be pushed off likely for some time. But we are still waiting on confirmation from SpaceX on that. Uh, meanwhile, Sam, two American astronauts are stuck on the International Space Station because their Boeing Starliner capsule couldn't bring them back to Earth safely. So they're supposed to hitch a ride with SpaceX in February. Could this ground stop delay their return even more? It, it, it possibly could. You know, that, that NASA launch that is supposed to happen uh, with two astronauts, it was four, but now they need room to bring the two others that are up there back, uh, was supposed to take place in September. Um, those astronauts are not supposed to come back until February, so we still have some, some time there. So it really depends on how long this review and the findings, what those findings are, will determine when that launch happens and when those two other astronauts that are in space right now uh, that went up on that Boeing Starliner come home. All right, ABC News transportation reporter Sam Sweeney, thank you. Thank you.